going to see that bet? What about that fancy knife you got there? <laughs> Looks like you lose it all, stranger. Looks like we got us a cheat at the table. The kid's been cheating all along. Stranger. may have bested the kid, but he had paid dearly for the privilege. He had no gun, no friends, and only a few dollars in his pocket. If he wanted to live longer than tomorrow, he'd have to find these things. Was he desperate? Let's be charitable. The stranger was, when we first met him, crow bait. Time and back didn't look like much either. Still, we had everything he needed to survive. What do you want, you knock-kneed pup of a desiccated sow grizzly? It's near on midnight. Well, it ain't exactly Paris, France now, is it? Lord almighty, man. This is Diamondback. Diamondback, New Mexico territory. In the year... Uh, in the year... 1880... 1880... Two, yeah, 1882. Don't interrupt me, boy, else I'll whoop your damn ass. Diamondback, yeah, if ever a pissy or piss ant town existed, then I don't know it. Yeah, you hear that? This town's crawling with thieves, flim flammers, and lawyers. And from the looks of you, you'll fit right in. I'm awful busy to talk fast. I don't give a coyote his rosy red behind. Where are you from for the night? There's a hotel down there on Main Street. Find it. Go on then, vamoose. You darn city fathers. Why they didn't bribe the railroad to get a train stop in here, I just don't know. Now out of my way, force it gets riled. 
Don't you touch that, boy! It's valuable! There's liquor in there! The dog. He is not happy to see Stranger. You won't get past him by being stupid. Don't give up too quickly. In time and back, remember. Brain first. Eyes second. Look, listen, talk to many people, very many, and read, if you can read. No, 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 no. Don't be impatient. I explain everything. Find a bone. Give it to the dog. Well, why are you standing there? Do I have to get it myself? Go, 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 go. Hopeless case. You're not so stupid after all, stranger. Help is glad to make your acquaintance. I own this shop. If you need help, come see me. Do you want more help, or do you want to keep moving? Okay, stranger. Now, you pay attention to help. This is very important. Very, very, very important. You don't listen, you'll be a Dead stranger. <laughs> Remember, the mouse is your hands, the keyboard is your feet. When the hand cursor appears, there is something to click on. You can talk to people too. Click on them with your mouse. Listen to what people say. Listen carefully. When you ask them questions, think before you click. The first question you see is not always the best one. Remember to listen. People in this town talk a lot. They tell secrets. They tell advice. Sometimes they tell lies. Remember. Listen to what people say. Listen carefully. You can give them things from your inventory. Now, take this old ring. It's a gift. Now go. The wife is going to be plenty angry at help to find me up this late. Good night. Right there. You new in town, ain't you? Hot dang! Jackalope Jones can spot a tenderfoot faster than a perspirating palomino can of piece of shade. Welcome to Diamondback, Buckaroo. <laughs> Shh. 
sheriff? <laughs> there ain't no sheriff, least one that's drawing breath. I'm a cowpoke, buckaroo. Ride anywhere on the good night loving trail. Look from Fort Concho to Denver and you'll find no rider faster or smarter than Jackalope Jones. No, I'm here a courting a gal by the name of Mountain Laurel. Hoo-wee! She's got more independence than five Fourth of Julys. Throws off about as many sparks, too. Her two hobbies is smoking cigars and giving me hell. Use a reasonating man, Buck. Obliged. Yeah. Cobb and Dale Belcher. Them kill peckers own the entire town. The Uni tribe, till the cavalry done marched them clear to Arizona, called it pacification. Dang, hornswoggled was more like it. Soon as they left, some eastern outfit began prospecting on their land. Rumors they's reopening the old devil's breath mine for pyrite. <laughs> the mayor's behind it. He's so greedy he'd skin a flea for its tallow and hide. There was, till yesterday, when Sheriff Bill Purvis shot Croc Granger and his wife dead. We found Purvis in the boneyard, hung himself. Who can say? They didn't do nothing. Old Purvis was right addled in the head. Combination of heat, dust, and Leroy's rock gut will do it every time. Jeez, Buck. For someone who ain't too smart, you sure do ask a lot of questions. Hoo-wee! At least you's bright enough to grasp the obvious. Diamondbacks out of money, law, and luck. Be a ghost town soon enough. You need a gun, Buck. Diamondbacks full of lawlessness. I'd watch my step. This town's biggest manure piles walks on two legs. To outlaws, justice ain't no blind lady. It's a Winchester. Since you ain't totin' no gun, Buck, don't you take no risks. Pure pitiful. Let me think. Hmm. Everything's closed now. Use out of luck. The hard drive. I done told you. Buck. You's too stupid to be running around without firepower. Any time, Buck. Poor Buck. Whatever kicked you in the head kicked you hard. Put it away, Buck. You want Laurel to see that? She'll have me hitched in no time. Moseying? See you around, Buck. Keep your boots dry and nose clean. Wait, Buck. Seeing as you's a few bales shy of a load. Here, a little luck for the poker table. Adios, amigo.
The target range is closed. Come back tomorrow when we can both see straight. been here before, have you, stranger? All drinks is a dollar, and I don't give no credit. Just talent is at your service. Talk? About what? You don't know too many Diamondback folks. Come back tomorrow when you've met some. Take care of yourself. Bye, friend! I already seen three dead men this week. If strangers don't stop pestering me, I may see a fourth. Look here, boys! Another stagecoach Johnny's just walked through the door. Cute, too. Hey, Johnny, the name's Una. Una Canute. I own this here cantina. What can I do you for? Go on. You don't 
need mama to show you how to nurse a bottle, do you? Hustle up some fun on your own time. You're wasting mine. And you're overstaying, you're welcome. Mr. Callan, show Johnny the door. So hey, sugar, how about a fast hand of blackjack? Have a seat, cowboy. I'll make it worth your while. All right now. Place your bet. That's the way the cards fall. Another hand? Put your silver on the green, cowboy. Sugar, you just took the knock. Another hand? Come on, Wrangler, make your bet. You're broke, sugar. <laughs> Come back when you got money. You're unarmed. What a relief. Oh my, yes. We allow no guns here. Not at the cactus bed. No, sir. How may I help you? A room? He wants a room? Stranger, we're full up. Just siree, Bob. We're booked up. Oh my, yes. Booked? I am not currently taking gentlemen callers, so I sure as hell ain't taking to you. Huh? Baby, if you was a gentleman, you wouldn't have talked to me. And if I was a lady, I wouldn't have responded. Now there's a compliment. I sure am. And when the Aspen goes gold, I'll be back at it. This place? Shoot. Jackie and I's in room two, next to the Frenchie. Put a horned toad in his bed. <laughs> Did he scream, my? <laughs> I never saw that toad again. We surmised the Frenchie ate it. Man, such predictable minds filled with more fire water than actual fire. Talk to me again, stranger, and you'll find a bullet in your head as a nighty night from me. Monsieur. May I most humbly present myself. I am Buick, Buick Riviera, man of many plans. Et vous? No doubt, mon ami, you think Buick Riviera, he is from France. 
<laughs> and you are right. <laughs> Did I not tell Monsieur that I have many plans? Nouvelle Mexico, like the young Nubile. She is paradise on Earth. I ache to possess her. No, 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 no. I am, how you say, busted. But, shh. I do not publicize such information. The manager, Monsieur Fierwit, he gets so excited if you have no money. <sighs> My father, the Duke, died defending France from the Prussians. Brave? Mais oui. Noble? Certainement. But smart? Pfft. He left me penniless. Regardez. I, Buick Riviera, man of many plans, end up in Diamondback seeking the monies. Merci, monsieur. He understands. Oh, he does. You are a genius. You are an artiste. You are riche. But you can be. Visit the hard drive. Poker. Jack Black. And the machine the sluts. They await you. But of course. Making the exit, mon ami? Au revoir. Guess some of the trash wasn't swept off the street. Stay away from Mountain Laurel. You hear? <laughs> now, Buck, you sure is slow, ain't you? I can't talk just now. Hello there, friend. What'll it be? Talk? About what? You don't know too many diamond bat folk. Come back tomorrow when you've met some. No problemo. Hasta la vista, baby. Hmm. Now where have I heard that before? You can't go up. I told you once. Stay away from my girls. The stagecoach Johnny's just walked through the door. <laughs> Cute, too. Hey, Johnny, the name's Una. Una Canute. I own this here cantina. What can I do you for? <laughs> Haven't seen a body.
somebody that fast since Lola Montez worked the gold rush in Cali. <laughs> I use fresh, all right. Don't know. Got all kind of games. What you play's up to you. Hooey Sal, my Kyoto man. He don't speak English none. And we don't know a lick of Japanese. But he makes himself understood all right on the piano. Ain't you the curious one. Hell, Johnny, I've got the pickiest gals in the territory. Nobody's good enough for them. Don't expect you'd be any different. From the looks of you, you'll favor Ruby. Knock on room four. So long, Johnny. Remember, if you want to go upstairs, talk to me first. It's Sal. Give us a new number for the new number. You can't go up. You and every man in here. You got money? It's ten bucks. Why you's as poor as a church mouse. So long, Johnny. Come back when you got silver rubbing against your pocket, not just desire. Unless you want to part with that ring you got. That ring's nice. Too nice for the likes of you. Ah, oh, what the hell, Johnny? I ain't gonna ask questions. I'll take it. Go on up. in Chihuahua, Mexico. I sing. We was touring, see? My manager, Cy, the bastard, snuck out on me. So the old gal downstairs, Una, she tells me I can stay until I've paid off my bill. You a rich cowboy? You don't look like no rich cowboy. Double light, I'm in need of some fire. <laughs> you know, stranger, you're kinda cute considering you ain't had a bath recently. Forget the Siggy. Maybe you should be nicer to Sophie. Maisie, she's in room three. She's kinda cute. But as for that shanty Irish slut, ha! If Ruby's so tough, why does she hide a pistol in her bedside drawer, I'd like to know? Her and her superior airs. Yeah? Well, you're looking at more now. Ha! What do you know? I'm gonna be a big one day. Just you wait. You going? That's all right. I gotta practice. Do re mi fa so. <clears throat> so. Come back anytime, but you better be prepared to make Sophie happy. I can be plenty nice if you do. She's 
Jesus Christ and General Jackson, don't you know better than to come barging into a room, even here? Go away. What you staring at, cowboy? Ain't ever been in a gal's boudoir before? Go on now. Get! Look, cowboy, the only thing not for sale in this hurdy-gurdy is a gal's break time. You're crowding it on mine, so... Oh, what the hell. You're persistent, I'll grant you that. The name's Ruby O'Dowdle, cowboy. Let's take a look at you. You don't smell too bad. <sighs> yeah, right. Look, you're beginning to bore me. Why don't you come back when you dry out a little behind the ears? We'll have tea. See you around the prairie, cowboy. Go listen to Sophie strangle a few notes. I'm busy, cowboy. I'm resting. Come back when I'm receiving company. You got about as much chance with me as a sinner in hell with kerosene underwear. No thanks. Go listen to Sophie strangle a few notes. I'm busy, cowboy. I'm resting. Come back when I'm receiving company. You got about as much chance with me. Go listen. I'm resting. Look here, boys! Another stagecoach Johnny's just walked through the door. <laughs> Cute, too. Hey, Johnny. The name's Una. Una Canute. I own this here cantina. What can I do you for? Go on. You don't need mama to show you how to nurse a bottle, do you? Hustle up some fun on your own time. You're wasting mine. You know how to flatter a girl, Johnny. I blew out of Frisco and got my skirts caught here in Diamondback. From the looks of you, you'll favor Ruby. Knock on room four. So long, Johnny. Remember. If you want to go upstairs, talk to me first. It's out. Give us a new number for the new number. You can't go up. That ring's nice. Too nice for the likes of you. What the hell, Johnny? I ain't gonna ask questions. I'll take it. Go on up. Jesus Christ and General Jackson, don't you know better than to come barging into a room, even here? Go away. What you staring at, cowboy? Ain't ever been in a gal's boudoir before? Go on now. Get!
Look, cowboy, the only thing not for sale in this hurdy-gurdy is a gal's break time. You're crowding it on mine, so... Oh, what the hell. You're persistent, I'll grant you that. The name's Ruby O'Dowdle, cowboy. Let's take a look at you. You don't smell too bad. Is that a fact? You hungry? Remind me, I'll feed you some tomatoes. You could squeeze them, but not too hard. Tomatoes, you know they can go all mushy on you. It would appear you know some pretty easy customers. Listen now. Give me your attention. You know, cowboy, when I was 19, I left Ohio greener than May corn. Landed in Virginia City at the height of the silver fever. Had no money and I had to eat, so I hung my sign on the line. About a year later, Ben O'Dowdle married me took me to his ranch here in New Mex. The cholera took him seven months later. The bank took the rest three months after that. So, here I am. When I ain't pushing drinks, I'm pushing smelly cow hands out of my room. It might. When you find some hot water to put yourself in, let me know. Look, you're beginning to bore me. Why don't you come back when you dry out a little behind the ears? We'll have tea. See you around the prairie, cowboy. give you a big surprise. You a rich cowboy? You don't look like no rich cowboy. Double white? I'm in need of some fire. <laughs> you know, stranger, you're kind of cute considering you ain't had a bath recently. Forget the Stiggy. Maybe you should be nicer to Sophie. Maisie. She's in room three. She's kind of cute. But as for that shanty Irish slut, ha! If Ruby's so tough, why does she hide a pistol in her bedside drawer, I'd like to know? Her and her superior heirs. Sophie Della Casino, toast of seven states, two territories in Chihuahua, Mexico. I sing! Say that about me. Funny, ain't it? You a rich cowboy? You don't look like no rich cowboy. Double light? I'm in need of some fire. <laughs> you know, stranger, you're kind of cute considering you ain't had a bath recently. Forget the Stiggy. Maybe you should be nicer to Sophie. Ben 
impressive, but I'm more. Let me tell ya. No thanks. You going? That's alright, I gotta practice. Do, re, mi, fa! 